Welcome to Flight Quick Tips number 10, Reversals, Turns, and Rapid Bleeding of Speed. Now I've been asked a surprising number of times, so much so, in fact, that it's probably my most requested Flight Quick Tips. And that's how do I turn so quickly, or how do I drop all my speed by turning? So in this Flight Quick Tips, I'm going to try my best to show you how I do that. Now let's start by talking about reversals. A reversal is a turn that is meant to reverse your direction of flight, preferably as fast as possible. Now the first type of reversal I'm going to cover is a SAR reversal, also known as a stall turn. It gets its name SAR reversal because search and rescue helicopters often have to follow a very strict pre-planned flight path. So if they believe they've spotted something and they need to reverse direction, they'll want to do that without having to deviate from their flight course. It's also probably the most simple reversal you can do that allows you to turn on a dime. Now because it's a rather easy reversal, and because you'll be flying back on the exact same flight line, it can be extremely useful when doing strafing runs. Because when you use it with strafing runs, it basically allows you to return exactly on the same flight line, allowing you to massively reduce the amount of time it would normally take to line back up on your target. Now I did imply that I had another type of reversal, but to be honest, this next one is more accurately just how to do a sharp turn. Now this type of turn can also be used to bleed off a large amount of speed extremely rapidly. So hopefully, this will explain the question of how I bleed off speed so rapidly by turning. Now to do this, it's actually rather kind of easy to get the hang of with some practice. So how you do this is you roll the helicopter almost completely sideways. Then you pull the cyclic all the way back to start turning. Your nose will also start climbing upwards a little bit. To counter this, and also to give your turn a little extra speed, you're going to want to bring your anti-torque pedal all the way in the direction you're turning towards the ground. In this case, I'm going to put full right pedal. Now to manage and keep yourself level and pointing towards the horizon, you're going to want to roll left or right slightly to make sure that you don't start pointing into the sky or nosing into the ground. Now the best way to practice this is really rather easy, and it's just to load up a helicopter into the editor and start turning in place. With enough practice, you should be able to do this indefinitely. Once you think you've got a good understanding on how to do this, you can then go ahead and practice doing U-turns to bleed off all your speed while in the air. Once you practice that a bit in the air, you can try to see about bringing that way of bleeding off speed into your landings. Now since this is, like I said, just a sharp turn, you can also use this for reversals or just general flight if you need to turn rapidly. That will conclude this flight quick tips. Feel free to check out my other videos in the meantime, but until the next one, I'm Patchwork and welcome to the war.